All right, hey everybody, today is the day. It's the last day of our program, Sabbath. Uh, it's gonna be a very, very special day today. As you know, if you've been following along, today is our big seminar that we're doing for the, for the community, the free community event called Climate Change. It just finished up, I don't know if you can see that, but printing these bulletins for our schedule that we're gonna be handing out. And so we're really praying hoping, believing, trusting that uh, the people are gonna come, that God has individuals that he's put it upon their hearts, laid it upon their hearts to come to this event. And so we'll see how it goes. And uh, yeah, so let's head over there. And unless you're hiding under a rock, you can't avoid it. Of madness or hysteria, demanding climate change, demanding action, demanding the governments of this world do something. Do you want to be strong? Yes. Do you want to have no fear when all the world is going crazy? Yes. Get to know your God. Get to know his love. Get the climate change in your heart. Be born of God and then know him on a website dedicated to this event that is to take place next May. They say the following. <clears throat> on May 14, 2020, Pope Francis invited representatives of the main religious represent, religions, representatives of international organizations and various humanitarian institutions from the academic economic, political, and cultural world to the Vatican. Together, representing who? The inhabitants of the earth. All right, I'm here with Linford Beachy. First of all, thanks Linford for joining us and coming all the way to help us out with the program today. How do you think it went? I thought it went fantastic. I really enjoyed it. Uh, it was a pleasure to be with the, the young people and see the fruits of the labor, their labor. So some of the people that mm. came out from the community, uh, I think it was wonderful. And what do you think about what these young people are doing? I can't speak enough how highly, uh, m I, m how much I appreciate the work that they're doing, uh, the work that you're doing, Brother Matt and DeMario. Um, with training them, and I just pray that this kind of work will grow, that it will go far and wide, and many other young people will be encouraged and be part of this movement. So, I'm very, very happy. I think the whole day was, for me was a blessing from the beginning, um, and just having the, the morning worship, and this morning worship was really impacted me. The one about he saved others, and the fact the fact that. Um, I guess I could say this on camera that even when you started choking up, as you were praying, I started choking up because the realization of what was happening, of what the Lord's really impressed upon all of us. Yes. What is the true gospel of like Christ didn't save himself, 
you know, that, that was his mission. He was saving others. So it was like, yeah. it was like a theme in my head the whole entire day. Praise God, me too. Amen. Yeah. He saved others. Yes, he saved others. Everybody's here in the fellowship hall, participating in the food. Brother DeMario, hey. how are you doing? Oh man, God is doing good in me, brother. Just thankful. Thank Another you for the day. message. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord. God is good, so it's been a blessed Sabbath. And I'm um, just still lavishing in His love, still lavishing in His spirit. So I'm um, thankful. The visitors that we had here, thankful for them. I got to visit a man uh, in Blairsville today. He was gonna be coming out, but something is wrong with his legs, so he wasn't able to meet him. That's when I went out there, but I prayed with him and tried to encourage him. And he said, I hope I get to see you again. So i uh, try to visit him one more time before mm -hmm. I head out. So uh, God is good, God is good. Hey ladies, how did it go today? Oh, how was the Sabbath day? It was heavenly. Heavenly? Uh, yeah, it was very inspiring. Oh yeah. The, the group singing was beautiful, and I thought the three messages, the sermons were wonderful. Oh, yeah. Oh, praise the Lord. They Very heartfelt. Inspiring. Yeah. Praise God. Yep. Wonderful day. Gary. Good service, Matt. Brother Matt. How'd it go today? Good. I'm doing real good. Yeah? What'd you think about today? I think it's been wonderful. It's just like a piece of heaven. Oh, I think the young people are wonderful. They're wonderful. They're, they're welcome at my table in my house any day. Any day? Any day. Yeah, what do you think about getting them out there and working more? I, Reaching, think, that's, I think that's a wonderful idea. Reaching the people. I really think that's a wonderful idea. Praise the Lord. Malcolm? The messages today were really good. Um, Matt, Linford, and DeMario presented, and we're just so grateful. Uh, DeMario really brought it home with a strong appeal. We had some altar calls, so we went up there receiving special prayer, and that was a blessing. So uh, we had a few come out who we invited from the community, and so praise the Lord for that. It was absolutely incredible. Such a blessing. I don't know what to say. Praise God for the three powerful messages we heard about climate change and what the scriptures actually say. The music was such a blessing. We're all on fire from seeing these young people come in here wanting to go out and witness and work for the Lord and save souls. And me and my wife are doing the same thing. Praise, Praise God, it's just incredible. Praise the Lord. Yes, yes, such a blessing. Okay, well, there you have it. Today was a blessed day, uh, end of the Sabbath here. We had our uh, Sabbath service this morning and uh, spent some time together after lunch. We started our seminar, went through the presentations. We had uh, five people from the community that came out, praise the Lord, which is great because um, generally uh, around here, people are really open and friendly. But, uh, you know, you find that people are kind of stuck with their own ideas and their own church and everything, which is, which is understandable. But, you know, praise the Lord for the people that did come. It was just a, a blessing to get to know them and just was really touched by the sermons that were presented. And DeMario made an altar call and appeal. And it was just really, just overall, a really blessed day. It was, it was awesome. So I hope you've been enjoying all these videos and today was the last day that we were planning on doing them. But let us know if you want us to keep it going, if you want us to uh, continue to, to put out some vlogs about the journey that these young people are going to be taking from here on forward or forward on. So if that's something you want, then please let us know and please uh, like, share and subscribe the line of truth tell your friends tell all the young people you know that there is an army of truth headed to the world to take the everlasting gospel and the three angels messages amen amen